age. Did you think death would free you from your obligation? When the system fails, we will balance the scales. This is cruel territory now! This is what we've been preparing for! <laughs> the end race is upon us! Your skull will make a fine trophy. so bad. All right, we're playing Mono Green Stomp because this is the best deck in the universe. You have to play your Land of War Elves first turn because yeah. then you can play your Growth from the Ashes second turn and have ramped up to playing your Gigantosaurus on turn three. Danny, I know. Hmm? Go ahead and play it. 
The elves are the right play. Do you ever read your cards? Throw that one down. Draw out his counter spell. Dude. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. Let me get in there. No, 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 no. Just go, Holmes. It's over. Day nine gets defeated. <laughs> Magic the Gathering, it invented the trading card game genre. When I started playing it, when I was in sixth grade, I remember playing with this mummy card. The flavor text on this mummy talked about gouging the eyes out of enemies. And as a kid, I was like, oh, I'm 12 and I'm tough and this is for me. If you know nothing about magic at all, don't worry about it. Magic the Gathering Arena comes with a built-in tutorial that really teaches you everything you need to know to start playing. It has a whole bunch of really simple decks to start you off with five different colors, each of which that plays completely differently. You can find what style you enjoy. If you want to draw a bunch of cards and counter a bunch of spells, you can play like that. If you want to just blow up your opponent or summon a horde of tiny little creatures, you can do that. All right, I gotta, I gotta stop paying attention to my job here and actually win this game. Turn three, Gigantosaurus. That's how you do it. <laughs>